Hey, this is going to be a mini tutorial for anyone who I am trying to help set up their Genius page. I just needed a song to use as an example. So first, you're going to go to Genius, you're going to hit Add Song, and I'm already on this page. And the example song I'm using today is Tea Time by Ryan Oaks featuring Hoodie Allen. And this is good because it's two people on the track. So you're going to add the info, the artist, the title, tag. If you don't know, you can just put pop. You can add different tags later. Then you're going to like transcribe the lyrics here. Personally, the lyrics were in the description of the video. So so everything worked out. Also, you're gonna put this featuring producer, add any album, the release date, and then it's SoundCloud and YouTube link. But let's focus on the lyric. He didn't transcribe the intro, so we have to transcribe the intro, and it's Brian Oaks and Hoodie Allen are both speaking, so we have to differentiate. You first go to this little bracket thing, and you close it with slash, and it's gonna italicize them. So let's listen to the intro, and we can transcribe it bit by bit. So Ryan Oaks goes, wait, wait, wait. Hoodie Allen goes, bro, what is this? And he says, I think I need a tea time. Actually, let's listen to this again. So actually, this line is also Ryan Oaks, and then Hoodie Allen says, I think I need a tea time. So it's just trial and error. You gotta listen to it. it. It's cumbersome a little bit, but once you do it, after a while, it just becomes so easy and you're basically like a machine. So I'm gonna finish up transcribing the intro and I'll hit you back, okay? Okay, so in the very end of the intro, Ryan Oak says, actually, hold on, let me, let me go. And we need to transcribe it using an M dash, this little dash, let me, let me go. So that's just a very common thing that happens. You gotta know how to transcribe that correctly. Okay, moving on to the verse. This is Ryan Oaks. So let's go verse one. This is the header. And you gotta put who's vocalizing if it's more than one person. Then we gotta make sure it's up to genius standards. And I'll put the link to the standards below. It's just an entire list of what's acceptable. Like we do I'm instead of I'm double M. So we choose I'm instead of this one. So it's a bunch of stuff like that. Let me look through this next verse and see what's wrong. Okay, so this needs commas. Show up, be fake, then we gotta get rid of the asterisk. Shoot shit, look, comma, I'm one of the guys. And he excluded the and in then, so we gotta put that back. We also gotta get rid of that space, and then we go through the rest of the verse. Comma, and then I'll bow down, then you'll pull them strings. Dress so fresh, but your breath still stink. Gotta get rid of the asterisk. Then we're gonna just listen to the actual vocals and make sure that like what's here is what's being said in the song. He says, while you'll pull them strings. So in this case, he was probably probably wrote the verse out on his notes app and it was recording it and said while instead of then. But when he put the lyric, he just copy and pasted what was in his notes app. It's very common. He adds a yo. Let's just add the yo in front of let me. We need a comma right there. We need a comma right there. And then with cuz, okay, so it's about the spelling. So instead of C U Z, we do apostrophe, then cause. That's just the way they've done it. We've also got and I'm here that we just need to capitalize. Then we gotta get rid of this space. Okay, so there's a little bit of enjambment here, accidentally most likely. So we gotta move it down what I gross, but I'm passing my peers that you do in the most. Let's listen to it again. That you do in the most for, he added the comma, which is very good. And you're wondering why you're now tr starting to choke. And then this is the chorus. So we gotta add the heading, chorus. Ryan Oaks. At the end of lines, there's O's, and then there's a, I think a hey, as like a chant, and you add exclamation points since it's a chant. Okay, so I'm just gonna go through the rest of the chorus and add the chants at the end and clean it up. I believe B side is capitalized, so capitalize the B. Okay, so at the end of the chorus, you can hear Hoodie Allen say yo. I'm gonna make the executive decision to include it with his verse instead of in the chorus because of where it's situated. Oh, and I just made a mistake. I just corrected it. I accidentally did, I hit shift and I was trying to do this bracket. I accidentally hit shift and did the curved bracket. You don't want to do that. That messes shit up. If the yo was like said like maybe with the I don't instead of like completely after the line, I would have put the brackets and put yo and I would have put brackets up here like was with this. I just would have put it on the end with the extension. But since I'm including it with the verse, I don't need to do that. I can just put yo in front of that. So now we listen through Hoodie's verse and we're gonna just clean it up. With this, this is a person's name, so we gotta check if it's spelled correctly. 
Jewish, I believe that is capitalized. Hodian is Jewish, by the way. You can make an annotation about that later. Then this is a different language. So we gotta make sure it's spelled correctly. It means peace be upon you. So I'm just gonna add a comma behind there. Get rid of the asterisks. Gotta listen to it again because I don't know what he's saying. That shit is deaded. Oh, he said you instead of just the letter. And he also didn't spell with. So we gotta add that. So with this, he's actually, he's trying to say gonna but he's sorting it to gone. So we just add, we get rid of the E and we just add apostrophe because it's taking a place of the N N A or the N A, yeah. You gonna regret it, you gone regret it. Right, we your favorite pop punk band's favorite drunk jam. Oh, we killing them. So that's possessive. Then we gotta listen to Oh, we killing them. Oh, I just listened to the verse. I missed an ad lib. So there's a, a woo right there. He says something behind regret it and I don't know what it is. So I'm just gonna, when you don't know what it is in a transcription, you just hit that. And then since it's in the ad lib, I'm just gonna put it in parentheses. And he says, like, you play in tennis instead of I'm playing tennis. He says, okay, after tennis. And we gotta capitalize it. <laughs> That's a reference to a Fall Out Boy, the band. And you could also make an annotation about that because the lead singer is Patrick Stump and this, the band is Fall Out Boy without a comma. Till should be apostrophe till with two l's is like a cash register i'm the only one in this bitch like panic i believe that's a reference to a panic at the disco which is a one-man band and is associated with fallout boy so i'm just gonna capitalize and add the exclamation point to panic because that's how panic is stylized the chorus we can just copy paste and we gotta listen through to make sure it's the same oh yeah i think b line is also capitalized so i'm just gonna go back and capitalize it in the previous chorus so ryan oaks doubles up on the chorus here so we can just add another chorus, it's fine. And in the outro, it's spoken. It's like a little conversation between Ryan Oaks and Hoodie Allen. Okay, so Hoodie Allen actually speaks first. So he's gonna be the one in regular text. And then Ryan Oaks is italicized. <laughs> If you see, we're at the end of the song, so we should be good. I would recommend just going through listening to it again, since you're probably going to be like a new transcriber. Okay, so if this all looks good, I'm going to add the YouTube link, and it's probably a SoundCloud link too. You can also add this later and edit it later. So we got performed by, written by, and produced by. We only need written by and produced by, so I'm going to add these in. Okay, if you see with this one, Hody Allen actually didn't write this. He only like performed it. So that means we got to add this dude and this dude as well. Hopefully that's him. And it's produced by Jaden Seeley. All right. Release date was October 2023. And it was the 20th. Okay. So he has a SoundCloud link. I go to YouTube and I copy the link address and I paste it back here. Okay, we should be good to help submit song because there's no album that it's on. And it's gonna look like this. Personally, I have the view old song page. That's what I am accustomed to. But for this, I'll just do it on the new song page. First, we need to change the cover art. Go to edit metadata then song art. If you have the song art for your own song, you can just upload it to Imgur or whatever and just paste the URL here. But I need to find the song art. Okay, so you're gonna go to this website. If you can't find it online, because sometimes you can just search up Ryan Oaks Tea Time and it'll come up. But we're gonna Genius Graph. We're gonna hit iTunes artwork and we're gonna search best resolution for Genius. Copy image address. Then we just paste it in here. Then we hit save and boom, we got the cover art. This is the old song page, by the way. This is what I'm accustomed to. Okay, so we're almost done. So I put rap as the main tag. And here, I'm just putting rock. I don't know what it looks like on the new song page. Okay, you'd hit edit metadata, and then you would add your tags, like rock rap. There we go. Then you'd hit save. So you should be good. I think that's it. I really hope that's it. I'll leave the link for all the guides below on like the spelling and the punctuation but that should be it 